Here's another night crawler for Cinderella. I'll see if she's hungry. She usually easily eats a couple night crawlers. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Suck it down. That's three night crawlers. <laughs> Anyway, my wife told me that it'd be best if I at least get these big old guys to be hand-fed. And it's worked out really well with the uh, fire eel, but the uh, tire track eel, not so much. And uh, this is another little picture of my friendly male ghost knife fish. I don't know if you can see his head very well, but uh, this is a male ghost knife fish, I believe. I'm still trying to get a breeding project going in the aquarium uh, to my left. But so far, I haven't had any success. It's uh, just something I wanted to try. Boy, oh boy, I think I got a really great shot of his facial features there. That was excellent. I've got these things set up uh, in hides so that I can actually see the ghost knife fish very easily while it feels very comfortable because of the um, I don't I'm not sure exactly how they sense that they're uh, in a safe place but they like uh, to be inside of things and uh, you can see his uh, anal opening there it's slightly a yellowish white color that's where they poop right from between their gills they are amazing creatures anyway this is supposed to be a eel uh, picture. She's just going to wait for me to maybe give her another night crawler. But really, three night crawlers, that's probably enough food for her for another day.